This will be a store tour of the Yonkers located at the Merle Hay Mall in Des Moines, Iowa. Yonkers at the Merle Hay Mall originally opened in 1959. The store really didn't change much until 1978 when it was completely destroyed by a fire, which killed 11 people and is still the most deadly fire in Iowa history. After the fire, they rebuilt the store all brand new. Also around this time, they opened a home store into the space that is currently now Kohl's. That home store closed in 1991. In 2000, Famous Bar, a department store chain based in St. Louis, took over the old Montgomery Ward space at the mall. They completely gutted and remodeled the store, but only four years later they closed in 2004. Yonkers saw the opportunity and only a month after Famous Bar closed, they reopened in the Famous Bar space. The store was shiny, new, and perfect, and they didn't even have to pay for the remodel great deal for Yonkers. The old Yonkers was eventually demolished and turned into a Target store. In 2018, Yonkers' parent company, The Bonton, declared bankruptcy and was eventually forced to have to file for bankruptcy. That This meant the end to Yonkers in Iowa and Merle Hay Mall. So now we're going to start it off on the uh, lower level in the furniture department, which was something they only added in recent years. They had a section of the lower level walled off, which I think is from the um, furniture department conversion. Those are just a small fraction of all the store fixtures they're trying to sell off. In this video, for some reason, I had some video quality that really wasn't up to my standards. I really apologize for that. I'm really trying to do better at that. Right here is some of the uh, Christmas stuff they had here. is a bit of a weird setup because of the hills. Yes, they do have hills in Iowa. Uh, the mall entrance actually is on the second floor. There's no mall entrance on the first floor, but there's two exterior entrances on the first floor, then one exterior entrance on the second floor. I know, really exciting stuff. To most people, this store would look more like a Macy's than a Yonkers. This store actually could have been a Macy's if Famous Bar decided to stay open for about two more years. So, th 
There are currently no Macy's in Iowa, and I could see this is one of the few markets that Macy's could potentially expand to. Here, they wouldn't have to do literally any remodeling, and they could just open it, and it would look exactly like a normal Macy's. I have really low hope of that happening though, especially here at Merle Hay. If Macy's was to go anywhere, it'd be Jordan Creek. This would be the elevator at Yonkers at the Merle Hay Mall. In... The elevator was broken, so good job uh, at uh, ADA Access Yonkers. We have now made it over to Fixture Land in the area that was really starting to clear out in the store, as well as the men's department. That closed off a mall entrance goes straight into the food court, and right here is the uh, view from the food court. This was like, you know, my favorite time to capture these stores. It's like, you know, there's still a lot of stuff left, but there's also large swaths of the store that have been uh, cleared out and are empty. You kind of get to see the store as it would be normally, kind of, and you kind of get to see the store as it will be shortly. Oh yeah, you're also looking at the mannequin graveyard right now. As for the future of the store, the mall has said that they would like to uh, try to find a single-use tenant or just one store to fill the entire space up. Or they would even be willing to subdivide. They've not really announced anything, and in my opinion, it's going to take a while to get anything in here. Unless maybe they get like a Dillard's or a Macy's, but it'll be hard. I uh, wish this mall luck in trying to survive. Now we're taking a look at the uh, cosmetics department while I try to be sneaky with my phone. And now we're, now we're taking a look at the mall entrance. So even the outside of this store would look like a Macy's, just if you switched out the Yonker signs. Bonton stores nationwide are in their final days, and I have tried to film as many as I can. Uh, if you would like, you know, see more of those videos that I have not posted yet, you should think about subscribing and turning on that notification bell. And if you already subscribed and have turned on that notification bell, then good job. You are a good subscriber. Uh, thank you guys uh, for watching, and feel free to click on any one of those fine videos on the screen now. Guess what else is closing at this mall? It's Sears. <laughs>